today we are the 28th of September 2020 and I'm going to read a letter addressed to the parliaments of the world from the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia. Mr. President, following the unilateral attacks carried out by the Republic of Azerbaijan on September 27, 2020 against the Armenian civilian population and the Autonomous Republic of Artsakh, Nagorno-Karabakh, the deputies of the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia gathered today in a plenary session mandated me to communicate to all the parliaments of the world, to the media as well as to the general public, our strong condemnation of the well-planned attacks of Azerbaijan against the Armenian national territory of Artsakh. The National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia also calls on the international community and the Minsk group in particular to condemn this aggression of Azerbaijan in violation of international law and to participate in stopping these criminal attacks against Armenian civilian population through diplomatic channels for the restoration of order and an immediate ceasefire. The National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia denounces that these attacks were planned by Azerbaijan with the explicit support of Turkey. It should be noted that the Republic of Artsakh, Nagorno-Karabakh, has an indigenous Armenian population living on its lands for more than 10,000 years, with 95% of its population being Armenian in as a compliance with the rights of self-determination of indigenous peoples adopted by the United Nations on September 13, 2007. As usual, both Azerbaijan and Turkey distort the truth and historical facts. Their premeditated military assaults are being carried out while trying to disguise themselves as the victims. The National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia re reiterates that Azerbaijan as executor of acts of war and Turkey as accomplice and instigator will be held responsible for all human losses as well as material and moral damages. Renewing our deep gratitude and friendship mutual commitments in the framework of stability and world peace, the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia sends your assurance of its highest consideration, signed by Mr. Leonardo Basmadian, President of the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia. Thank you.